Okay, in summary, let's have concept. We have derived an expression for the conservation of momentum. We explain the condition for conservation of momentum. That is, it should there should be net uh, no net external forces acting on on a system. And for collisions, this is true because the interaction between two um, objects that are colliding are relatively large, much larger than the the, uh, the external forces that are acting um, uh, that are acting on the system. So, kaya pwede mong gamitan yung conservation of momentum in collisions. And then we also defined, um, we also differentiated um, um, elastic from inelastic collisions. Again, elastic collisions on all types of collisions, momentum is conserved, but only. Um, for elastic collisions where the kinetic energy is not um, um, is conserved and therefore no kinetic energy is lost. Okay. Now, next time, what we will be doing is to extend our discussion um, on 2D collisions and we will show you that because uh, uh, we asked earlier, why is it partially inelastic? Because it's impossible for 1D. You, can, you need to have a relationship between, between the velocities for you to have a partially uh, elastic collision. Uh, partially inelastic, I mean. However, in 2D collisions, it is possible to solve for partially inelastic collisions. We will show that next time. So are there any questions? Are there any questions? If there are no more questions, thank you very much for attending. And I see you all next time.